RER's Kampar Peninsula Eco Restoration Project is a complex, multi decade endeavour. To ensure successful completion, RER has developed a four step plan. The four steps can be summarised as protect, assess, restore, manage. The area must be protected from further damage caused by illegal logging, forest fires, illegal drainage canals and the clearing of land for settlement and agriculture. Specific solutions must be developed for each of these problems. So RER will invest more than $1 million to establish a land protection and supervision operation. A bordering acacia plantation will provide a buffer zone, helping to limit illegal access. RER will also work closely with neighbouring communities to build support for protecting the conservation area. A team of independent experts will assess the entire reserve. They will determine the extent of land degradation and establish a baseline inventory of the physical, biological and social environment. This work will become the foundation for restoration strategies. As peat forests are the result of interactions between plants and water, restoration will focus on these elements. Native plant communities will be re-established, and this will require a large ongoing supply of seedlings. To meet this demand, RER will create a native plant nursery training and employing local people. Meanwhile, illegal drainage canals will be disabled to help restore water levels. Overall, the restoration stage requires broad expertise, extensive fieldwork and a large, well-trained labour force. RER is building a management team with the skills this project demands. With considerable forestry science and management resources, the partners in this venture are well placed to help RER achieve this restoration. In 2013, a detailed management plan will be submitted to the Indonesian government. And as the project gathers momentum, other groups, such as scientific bodies, will have opportunities to bring additional expertise to RER. Throughout this eco-restoration, innovative thinking and practices will be needed to overcome the many challenges. But with commitment, resources and strong partnerships, RER is confident it can help safeguard this area for future generations.